When you have collected a number of lenses, you come to the question where do I store these lenses? You can keep them in a bag, which is handy when you go out. But I prefer to keep the lenses in a locked cabinet, so that they don't collect dust, but that I can also quickly reach for them here in my studio. But when you have several lenses in a row, it's not always handy this way. If you want to take a lens that is at the back, there is a danger that you will hit the other lenses. What the ideal solution for me is, is that the lenses are on a rotating platform. That way the lens you want to choose is always in front by turning the plateau. You reduce the risk of lenses tipping over in this way. The rotating plateau that I use is a so-called Lazy Susan, made of lacquered acacia wood. Such trays are often used for a practical presentation of cheeses, cupcakes, cakes or snacks. Those who are a bit handy can probably make this themselves, but for about $25 you can buy this ready-made. For that price you can hardly make it yourself. Keep in mind that the plateau must be able to rotate in the cabinet and measure in advance how deep your cabinet is so that the doors can close of course. In this case the rotating platform has a diameter of 33 cm. I personally find it easy to arrange the lenses by focal length. First I am placing the 300mm PF then the 70-300mm zoom lens, the 180mm f2.8, the 85mm f1.4, the 55mm macronicor, the 35 f1.4, the 24mm f1.8, and the 20mm f2.8. There you go, this is my way of stocking lenses. You can of course put several platforms next to each other if you need to. Hopefully you found it interesting and maybe you can use this method for storing your own lenses too. Thank you for watching this quick video and I look forward to see you in the next one.